morning, everyone. I'm Connie Myers. It is Saturday morning at 10 o'clock, well, a few minutes after. And so this has to be to 70 and beyond. I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Mine was very quiet, but I spent it with some really dear friends that I love dearly. And I actually did not eat too much this year. Although I did just have some leftovers for breakfast. Nothing like potatoes and gravy and turkey and a little stuffing to make for a perfect breakfast. Anyway, I hope you are enjoying all of the festivities of the weekend. This is my new little kitty. Her name is Millie. When, when Michael first brought her to me, she was like less than a pound. Now she's like seven or eight pounds. So she's grown a lot. She's not even a year old yet. But I named her Millie after my mom because she's feisty. She's funny. She's just busy, 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 busy. And uh, she's just a beautiful something I'm very grateful for. So last week I talked about what are we grateful for? What are we taking from 2022 into 2023? And I was listening to like yesterday, Friday, it was Black Friday. And today it's uh, Saturday, Small Business Saturday. And Monday is Cyber Cyber Monday. And I'm thinking, what? A, why do we have to wait till once a year to support other people, to uh, be aware of, they were talking about how many billions of dollars are being spent were spent yesterday and everybody was back in the stores. There were lines and all that kind of stuff. You know, leading up to the holidays, there's so much hype and so much going on. And for me this year, it's going to be really about my close family. And instead of giving gifts this year, I'm going to give donations. By the way, uh, the 29th is Giving Tuesday. So a couple of days from now. And if you have your favorite nonprofit, great. If you don't, I have a new nonprofit that you, if you would like to donate, that would be awesome. Um, I'll be posting some stuff on Facebook and LinkedIn and all of that about it. But if you have your favorite charity, don't forget them on Tuesday. So I didn't really want to take a lot of time. I just wanted to hop on and say, I'm thinking about all of you out there shopping until you're dropping. And what small businesses can you support today? I have, I have a couple of my own that I'm going to be going to visit. So um, find somebody that is really could use your support in their business. I mean, it's been a tough year for a couple of them. So be, get out there and support them as best you can. But maybe we could try to carry this um, generosity and our money over to other times of the year besides just these particular days and, and share the wealth, share what we've got. Even if you don't have a lot, um, to share. You can always share a meal. You can always share something. Um, and so Millie and I want to wish you a fabulous week. I am going to be leaving to go. I'm, I'm finally getting a chance to take some time off. I'm going to uh, go up to Morro Bay and it's up above Santa Barbara in California to watch the butterflies. And then we're going to go do a little wine tasting. So I'm taking a few days to recuperate and from these last crazy few weeks. But I'm hoping that you jump into the holidays with all the right generosity and all the right heart. And let's let's make this more about how we can give from our hearts versus giving from our pocketbooks and seeing what we can do. Volunteer some time somewhere. That's what I'm going to do. Anyway, I hope you have a fabulous week. I'm making this super short, super sweet because you're probably not listening anyway. Anyway, I love you all. Take care. And I will talk to you next week. I hope. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do it depending on where we are. So take care, my friends, and have a beautiful week. Bye now.